Now, two flash mobs were fired towards Israeli Prime Minister Netanyahu's home in North Israeli town uh, on Saturday and fell into the garden. Now, neither Netanyahu nor his family were present and there was no damage that has been reported so far. So this is in fact a matter of uh, a month. This is the second attack that is being witnessed outside the residence of uh, Benjamin Netanyahu uh, in his hometown. And uh, as of now, what we are getting to know is that uh, the uh, neither Netanyahu nor his family were present at uh, his home when this particular attack happened and there has been no damage so far. And uh, as far as uh, you know, the details are concerned, what we know as of now is that uh, two flash mobs, bombs were uh, fired towards Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu's home in North Israeli town and uh, this happened on Saturday and uh, the bomb in fact fell into the garden. Neither Netanyahu or his family were present and there was no damage that has been reported so far. So th we have been seeing, you know, the attack that has been happening uh, for a month now. And uh, let me now go across to my colleague Siddhan Mishra joining me at this point. Uh, Siddhan, so we, uh, in a matter of one month, we are seeing this is the second attempt uh, to attack the residents of Benjamin Netanyahu. Last time all, as, uh, as well, uh, he and his family were not present in the house. And this time as well, uh, no damage is, ha has in fact come to the fourth. Well, that's right. Uh, in fact, we have uh, this is being reported by uh, the news agency in Israel that two players uh, landed near Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu's residence on Saturday in the central town. And security services have uh, have described the incident as serious. The residence was earlier in October also targeted, Sharon, mm -hmm. by a drone apparently launched by Iran-backed Hezbollah. And Netanyahu at that time described it as an assassination attempt. So when it happened in October, at that time also the security agencies called it a serious incident. Netanyahu called it an uh, assassination attempt on him. This was perhaps for the second time that the two players have landed inside the premises of uh, uh, Prime Minister of Israel, Netanyahu. Perhaps this is also, Sharon, happening at a time when, you know, the geopolitical scenarios are changing after President Trump coming to power in the United States. Perhaps, uh, you know, it has a lot of meaning. Uh, and, and, you know, it would really be interesting to see that now what is going to be the Israeli response uh, and how would Netanyahu describe this incident? Because last time he called it an assassination attempt on him. What would be his response and his government's response this time around? All right.